What's up you guys, it's Matt here. So in this video, I wanted to go over a versus series. Last week I went over the Walmart credit card. So I wanted to talk about the Walmart credit card and it is by Capital One and I have gone on the record saying that I really didn't like Capital One and um, actually had um, just so, some sort of revelation really because um, Capital One is like, uh, the Capital One Quicksilver is my most popular video on my channel. Um, the card is supposed to be available on Tuesday, um, September the 24th. So coming up, um, they're supposed to have two cards, but I'm only going over one. And I decided that I wanted to do a Versus series because I did talk about um, other cards in that video, and it made me think about it. The reason why they're making this card is because of the whole Target card. They want to compete with being able to get 5% off and you know doing all of that. But jazz. Um, but I wanted to do a versus series just to see which one comes out on top. And I'll get into that in just a second. Before I start, I do want to remind everybody that I do a giveaway every single week. I give away two Amazon gift cards at the end of the week. And if you want to enter those giveaways, just comment on at least one video for the week, like at least one video for the week, and also be subscribed to my YouTube channel. If you do all of those things, then you get one ticket in the hat. If you want multiple tickets, then comment on multiple videos. I also wanted to tell you that I have a new Amazon storefront. If you want to check out that link down below where I have all of the different stuff that I that I use for my YouTube videos um, that I use in my daily life. And I plan on adding things to it. So go ahead and check that out right now. It's at the beginning stages. So these are a lot of the things that I that I have or I actually plan to have later uh, down the road. So um, go ahead and check that out. But let's go ahead and get into this video, the Walmart credit card versus the Target credit card. Um, I wanted to do this right from the start, but I wanted to really go over the Walmart credit card from the start because of the fact that it was a new card that was being released. So that was the whole thing that I really wanted to do. So let's go into the individual cards and we'll see which one comes out on top in my opinion. And then you can let me know how you feel in the comments. So first let's get into the Walmart card here. So if you remember from this card, you have a $0 annual fee. You also have 5% on purchases at walmart.com and uh, purchases through the Walmart app. Um, this includes um, items you buy online for in-store pickup and also the Walmart grocery pickup and delivery. So you have 5% on all of those different areas um, and that's only in the first 12 months. So it's basically the uh, starter uh, bonusable uh, period, I guess. If you wanted to look at a bonus, this would be the bonus. You get 5% back. Um, but then normally you go um, into Walmart and buy something, it's 2% cash back um, on all of your purchases. Also on Walmart gas stations, if they have it, um, you do have 2% back on travel and um, dining, and then you have 1% back on all other purchases. So the good thing about this card, um, which I'll get into later, is the fact that it's a it's not a closed loop card. It's open. So when you see travel and restaurants, you see all other purchases that can come from outside of the organization. So let's get into the red card and then we'll break down exactly how I feel about both of them. So the target card that also has no annual fee. You don't have to pay anything up front. Um, you have 5% off of basically everything, virtually everything in store and online. So there's no limit there. You don't have the 12 uh, month period that you have the card for. Um, you you also get free two-day shipping on all purchases. You also get exclusive offers such as buy two, get one free books, things like that. You get you get all of these exclusive offers that they do have when you have the Target red card. So um, that's definitely a plus in my book. You also have an extended uh, return period of an extra 30 days on all purchases. So if you have the card, you don't have to um, wait for I guess it's like 90 days or however long, you get an extra 30 days in order to return. So that's definitely a plus. And you get 15% off and free shipping on subscriptions for select brands of formula, diapers, and wipes. Um, the one downside to this, um, it's a closed loop card. So that's something that I don't like when you have something that you can only buy things at that store. Yes, I understand that you're gonna go to Target and you're gonna get 5% off every time you go there. But if you wanted to go somewhere else and you still wanted them to use that card, that makes sense to be able to partner up with somebody to where you can use it in other places. So my overall thoughts on this whole competition, um, so you have the Walmart card in one hand, you have the Target card in the other. 
what are the pros and cons, what really is better than the other. So when you look at the Walmart card, the fact that it's an open, um, it's not an, a closed loop card, it's an open loop card, um, that is an amazing um, deal because of the fact that you can go anywhere you want and get 2% on travel, restaurants, and get 1% back on all other purchases. So you can use it in other places if you don't have another card. If this is your first card, then you don't want to just limit it to using it at Walmart. If it's your third, fourth, fifth card, then you probably have other cards in different categories for those other areas. So it's probably not giving you any type of benefit by using it out elsewhere. Um, but the fact that it's an open loop card makes it a whole lot better for people that are starting out. So I think that that is a huge plus. Um, the downside to that card is the fact that they only have 5% at Walmart for the beginning period, the bonusable period, first 12 months. Um, and I, I don't like that because you look at Target, it's 5% off of virtually everything. Every time you go there, every purchase that you have, it makes sense to be able to have, you know, a hundred dollar purchase and get 5% off of that. So like the fact that you can only do it in certain areas with the Walmart card and it's only for the first 12 months is not a good thing. Um, but you know, Target is a closed loop card. So both of them have, have pros and cons in that area. So it's like one to one basically. Um, and then if you think about it, if you look at like, if you wanted extra things on travel on restaurants, I feel like the Walmart card has you there. Um, but with Target, you get free shipping, free two-day shipping. So it's basically like a competition um, with Amazon there because Amazon has the, the two-day prime shipping. Um, so you think about it, I mean, they're pretty neck and neck. The only thing is the fact that you get 5% at Target every single day. And most of the time, if you're an experienced um, person in credit cards and using credit cards and, and buying and um, spending money, maintaining your finances the right way, you're going to understand that 5% here is the best thing for you. And then you can get 3% with other cards, 4% with other cards, 2% with other cards, whatever. Um, so my, the way that I look at it, even though it is a closed loop card, I would have to say the target card is better. Um, just because you get that 5% in a, in a, a concentrated area. And I understand they're giving you so much more cash back for uh, the Walmart card. They're giving you it in different areas. So you can go out dining and getting all of that. But I'm, I'm looking at this as a person that already has a couple of credit cards and um, wants to gain cash back or points in a certain store, at a certain store. So the Target card is definitely the winner for me. If you feel like the Walmart card should win, then please comment down below and let me know the reasons why. Um, and in, in different situations, different cards will win. Like I said, a starter card, I would say the Walmart card could win because you're starting out, you're getting 5%, um, but you get 2% in so many different areas because you don't have other cards for those areas. So when you go out dining, you can use the, the Walmart card. So it, in certain areas, one will win. So Walmart card could win or the Target red card could win. So um, my opinion, in my opinion, in my situation or situation that's like half my level of credit cards, um, they probably would want to go with the Target card because it gives you so much more. So that's my video, guys. Um, just going over the uh, differences between the two and which one comes out on top. And obviously, you know, the the red card comes out on top for me. So um, again, let me know if you think otherwise or if you agree with me. Um, but that's my video. Hopefully you liked it. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. Also hit the subscribe button for more videos just like this one. And remember that I'm doing a giveaway every single week. I give away two Amazon gift cards at the end of the week. And all you have to do in order to enter that giveaway is just comment on at least one video for the week, like at least one video for the week, and also be subscribed to my YouTube channel. If you do all of those things, then you get one ticket in the hat. If you want multiple tickets, then comment on multiple videos. Five tickets is the max. So if you comment on one video, that's one ticket. Two videos, that's two tickets. Um, I'm sorry that I have to explain this so much in detail, but sometimes people don't get it. Um, but if you comment five times on one video, you're still only going to get one ticket for it. So um, I'm trying to make this as simple as possible. One for me and two for you. So um, please just try and follow the rules. If you want five tickets, comment on all five videos. So um, that's pretty much it. Um, if you want to see how the structure goes with the, the whole drawing, then I, I'll put the um, giveaways up in the cards. Um, it's probably already up there. Um, but 
that's my video guys and um i'm gonna have to get out of here and until next time i'll see you guys later